Did y'all see Blue betting thousands of dollars on some patents? Telling y'all, y'all gonna see her get popped one day. <laughs> Hey YouTube, it's Blossom here, and I was just coming in to give you guys my week two update with my stats, how am I doing on my diet, all the bullshit that I've been through, and etc. Let's see, where to start? So let me start off with my stats. So right now it is Sunday the 18th, and I am waiting on um, so far this week, I've lost an additional, I believe, nine pounds, I believe. Nine, it's somewhere in between nine and 11 pounds. I can't think of it at the top of my head. If I have to clarify it, I'll put it like right here. But, um, I'm finishing out the liquid diet, y'all. I'm over it. But the thing is, I, I, I'm supposed to start pureed tomorrow but I started it like Friday and when I tell y'all see I felt like I was having normal bowel movements this may be a little bit TMI I'm sorry but it's stuff that you I feel like y'all should know so I felt like I was having pretty normal bowel movements and I started eating puree food some foods I like some chicken I've eaten and I just like chewed it down real good and y'all my soul was taken out my body this morning like i made me some puree chicken and it looks disgusting but it's actually pretty fucking good it was puree chicken i put in a, uh what a little chopper thing i put in some tomato sauce i put in some italian seasoning and um i put in some taco seasoning that comes in a little packets and it ran through me and when i tell y'all you ever have the moments when you sitting on the toilet and you like, oh shit. Oh shit. I can't do this. Like, it felt like, how can I compare this to? Since it's YouTube, I can't compare it to what I really want to compare it to. And um, let's just say, I don't, if that's how childbirth feels, knock me out slice my stomach open because i'd be damn if i go through any pain similar than that like i used to really laugh at people when they'd be like yo i was just sitting on the toilet crying i get it home girl i get it boo because i was sitting on the toilet and i was really contemplating like if i should just let it sit there maybe you'll get smaller Maybe if I like I'm a soldier, no limit, just start pushing. And I even thought, damn, it's my butt. <laughs> oh my god. It was like I was thinking to myself, damn, is my butt gonna start bleeding? <laughs> and I was like, I can't do this. But then I was like, you know what, Tierra? You a grown ass woman. You about to sit your ass on this toilet. Sitting on the toilet! And you about to poop. You about to poop. You about to poop for your life. Like your life. Like if you, you can't get constipated, boo. And I got it out. And I'm a soldier. I need to get myself a little ribbon that says I pooped. It was really serious. Um, what else? So with the puree foods, I'm like already thinking a week ahead. I'm like, oh, I'm ready for the soft foods. But puree is actually pretty cool. I saw in the like the weight loss group that, I, that I'm in on Facebook, um, they said that you can eat refried beans, but I'm kind of nervous of eating refried beans because it's, it has beans in it. Um, I'm trying to keep my carbs down because I want to transition transition into being like you know having a keto diet, and um, I, I'm just nervous of carbs. I'm trying to figure out what all I can eat. I have a lot of soups. I have a lot of um, more soups. I have a lot of protein shakes and more protein shakes. It's like I may just do two protein shakes and um, a meal. One thing that I did see come in clutch is tuna. 
it's like this tuna with ranch tuna with uh, lemon pepper and when i tell y'all that i don't know if it's because i ain't been eating but that shit is amazing i'll be on the couch munching up on some tuna fish tuna fish good as hell in a video regarding bariatric facebook groups but i haven't uploaded it because it's like um uh, part of me is like uh do i really feel like offending possibly offending people right now and it's like eh, i don't know i may upload it tomorrow when i'm actually a week i meet with my doctor again on the 22nd well for the first time and right now i'm 246 but when i go see my doctor i want to be 239 and in order to do that oh, i'm sorry i'm burping y'all for y'all that had the surgery you know burping it's, it's normal and actually let me now go into what i remember i was about to say y'all i thought that my stomach had a leak in it because like i don't know about y'all but i've i don't know if i know how it feels to be full yet let me know if y'all like this because I drink my protein. I, last week I was drinking my protein shake and it's the Premier Protein and you know those are like 11 ounces. And legitly, I was halfway through it and I'm like, yo, ain't I supposed to be full? So I started panicking and I'm not one of those people that just run to Facebook groups and like, what's wrong with me, am I dying? I just started Googling, YouTubing it and I came across a YouTube page of, I guess, a doctor. And he said that you have to take into consideration that it's a liquid your stomach is really small obviously but since it's a liquid it just goes straight through your stomach it may like sit there for a second but it's going to get released soon so after looking at that i'm like okay well i'm not fucking dying and i didn't explode my stomach I, on wednesday i think i may upload a gym video because i started going back to the gym recently and i'm just walking i'm not working out so don't you know say you need to wait i'm just walking and doing cardio so talk to you guys soon i need to figure out a freaking outro or something or just how to exit because i'm an awkward person and if i if i exited out the way i want to it's like okay